Well, you see, in that scenario, even as a layman, how do you find it? Uh, it was surprising to some of us because okay. we have not seen that happen. Good. Perhaps because we're not also legal officers who had also been, been, been in the courts consistently. Yeah, but if it was something that uh, could be fairly done or properly done, why is it that was never happened? What has been the standard practice? No, it's not a question of practice. Article 1, um, Four, four, six, or so. The constitutional amendments and related mm -hmm. to it. It's clear, and that I've dealt with that in my speech also. That when the, uh, <clears throat> in the absence of the, 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 the chief justice, or if the chief justice is unable to act for any reason, the, ne the next, the most senior justice acts until the chief justice is able to resume. The functions. That is a clear constitutional provision. And in Masi, when you read it, I say, look, some chief justices to our oh, Africa, this thing is there, but they will look among the judges and think that, oh, these are close to me, the others maybe are pro here. And so, so if the most senior is not in, uh, close to him or her, some of them, when they are traveling, they will swap and hand over secretly to somebody who is not the most in the box, close to them, to be running affairs. OK. Yes. And even if they will give things to the next person, they are just inconsequential things, I mean, petty, petty things, mm. you see. And I noticed, I, look, Redu suffered that thing, Redu, before he became Chief Justice. Whenever um, Aban traveled, mm -hmm. I didn't want to mention it, but let's uh, do it for clarity. His cousin, Ampia, was virtually the acting chief justice in his absence. And not the next senior most. Redu was the next most senior. He was always at that. OK. And I remember vividly, on one occasion, Redu thought this was too much. Uh, there was uh, the annual uh, judges' conference. And it's normally addressed by the Chief Justice, flanked by the Justice of the Supreme Court. And Ampia was going to do it. Redu went in there and said, no, he is the next most senior. He is to do this. And I think Ampia had a, a speech for him to He said, no, he will read his own speech. I see. All that. Except in this case, the, the subsequent justification is that yeah. this was during break. This was yes. during the judicial break. Yes. So that case could not be listed during the judicial break. Oh, I don't think so. Don't you have vacation judges in the high court? Vacation, urgent matters can be dealt with during vacation. That's a mm. settled practice of the legal system. Urgent matters. And even, I think I never do, there were vacation, call of a few vacation judges. He even mm. introduced that. It's not illegal to sit during the vacation. And even with the consent of the parties, you can try a substantive case during the vacation. Even at the Epis Court? Oh, why not? It's the same rule. It's not the same vacation. Is it possible the rules have changed? Well, I've left since, as I've told you, I've closed my mind. <laughs>